Well, howdy do. It is me. And we're back with Final Fantasy XIV. And like I said last episode, I was going to basically um, cut, bas cut to um, our location where we needed to be. So that I didn't waste time, you know, traveling back. So, uh, we are back at Bruchet's. So let's talk to, uh, uh, Buscarin. Uh, ah, you've returned. Thank you for seeing Tetarun's belongings to him. What's this for? For me? Yeah. I'm not doing that, babe. Uh, Kikirin, uh, Kikirin Firewater? So he remembers my fondness for the drink, does he? Uh, why that old... Uh, he, I... Ah, oh, bloody hells, who's cutting onions back here? Ah. He says to shelf it for a year, does he? Nah, that sounds about right. I hate to have to wait, but I reckon it'll be worth it. This stuff has an aroma and body unlike any other drink I know. It's going to be a long year. What say you come back then, friend? We'll see if uh, we'll see if we can't make it through this bottle together. Aww. What can we get? I haven't been really using this. Or I haven't been using my Aether potions a lot. Um... So I don't think I'm gonna... Uh, more Disciple War stuff. Okay. Uh, there was there was word while you were away. Sylphs were seen in the wood, but near no lands of their own. No, this was a... Uh, there, this... Oh my god. No, this was a place near to here. A place we've never known a Sylph to come. Something must have given them cause to venture this far. More than like the missing Sylph elders among them. Here, I've marked the tract where they were sighted on your map. Go see if there's anything to be seen. Cool, cool. Uh, one moment, uh, as I quickly do something. Alright, I'm back. Okay. Just had to close some windows. Alright. So we need to investigate some areas, I see. Um, okay, they're around here. I'm not gonna join this fate. I'm just gonna do my own thing. So that's one area. Also, like, so last episode I was like, yeah, I sure hope that it stops raining and thundering. And it's raining and thundering, so. Um, yeah, I'm kinda sad about that. Okay, I thought I was gonna get spotted there for a second and I got kinda worried. Oh. Hello. What are you doing there? Okay. And the other areas are... Oh. Oh boy. They are uh, past where the fate is. Well. I really don't want to be a part of that. Is it on top of the cl no, it's around. Okay. Let's 
so I'm gonna need to make my way around this little plateau. Um. Oh yeah, it's up there. Okay. I also have a few. I also. We can also um. Was it go to the quarry mine? And uh, get that aetherite while we're while we're here. So that uh, we have a place to uh, teleport to if we ever like go. Hello. Oh, there's two of you. Let's actually head off into the uh, the, the uh, quarry mill over there and the tune. That's a shit ton of people. Why are there so many? Jesus. I wish this rain would just let up. Oh boy. I'm going the wrong way. I'm going around in circles, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for not helping these people, but like honestly, I'm just trying to get through Do my own thing Alright, uh, so was there ought to be found in the wood? What did you, uh, what did you come to? Garleans in this part of the Twelves Wood? Hmm First Sylphs and now Garleans, and all in the same place. It cannot be mere coincidence. Might the Garleans be following the Sylphs, tracking them, or giving chase, mayhap? But no, this uh, not this far into the forest. The Whalers' spires are everywhere. Imperials could never have stolen past them all. How in the bloody hells could they... Unless... Unless someone guided them through. Someone who knew where the spires stand and when the Whalers watch. A Gridanian traitor. Uh-oh. Uh oh, SpaghettiOs, we gotta- It's another traitor! It's always a traitor. Yikes. Alright. Uh, let's see, a Novo... Novo Reich? Rich? Reich? I don't know. I'm glad you've come, friend. There's something I want to talk to you about. You uh, you know I said I thought we might have a traitor in our midst. Someone as uh, someone as was aiding the uh, the guardians. Well, I'm thinking I may have identified our suspect. There's a regular of mine who used to dine on thin soup and sip his pint on account of not being able to afford another. But as of late, he's taken to ordering my best wines and the finest cuts of meat I can lay my hands on. Were he a merchant, I'd probably think nothing of it, but this wood's a lad- uh, uh, this lad's a wood whaler. And wood whalers don't earn that kind of coin. By chance, I was musing, uh, on where the money was coming from when you first told me about the garleans in the forest, and I couldn't help putting two and two together. Suffice to say, if a whaler is working for the Empire, none of us are safe. The lad I'm talking about goes by the name Laurent- Laurentius? 
Uh, last I heard, he was in the South Shroud. Find him, Atelios, and if he is up to no good, put an end to it. End him, if it comes to that. Alright, so he's basically- Okay, so you're basically giving us the A-OK -okay to just kill the traitor. So, if I do end up killing him, it's not gonna- <laughs> It's not gonna really be, you know, on my conscience, I guess. I mean, of course it is, but... So it says that... Hmm. It says he's in around here. But where... Oh, I see. I see you, I see you. What are you doing all here, over here? Uh, can you not see I am on a patrol? Be gone. If you have business with the whalers, take it to the barracks. Oh. No, no, no. That that can't do. Nah, dude. Alright, where is he now? He's over here. Hey, buddy. I'm gonna have to talk to you again. Ah, there you are. I can't walk there. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to join a fate. You again? I told you I'm busy with my duties. Now piss off. Oh, wow. He went all the way up here this time. He ain't playing around. this way. Why are you hiding all the way over here? Not long now. <laughs> I think patrol routes and rations would fetch such a price. Are you talking to yourself? <laughs> no more than I deserve, though. It's just a little wonder the Empire has risen to such heights. If only the whalers paid men their worth. Y you How did you- How long have you- <laughs> Help! 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 Oh, no. Please, come quick, my friends. It is I, Laurentius. I am under attack. Oh, it's just one person! Alright, buddy. Let's talk. I like how I said speak with Laurentius again. How? How did you? You just... I, I know nothing. I was on patrol. He just appeared. I, I thought you were look, uh, You were working for the Garleans. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Where is he now? Oh, my God. He's all the way... Alright. All the way over here. Ow. Chill, buddy. There he is. You're not very slick, you know? Why are you following me? Leave me be. I told you that Garlean just appeared. I know nothing. Oh my god, how long are we gonna have to do this, buddy? How long are we gonna have to chase you down? Because we know you're guilty. We know. Over there? Yep. Laurentius. We know you're guilty. Alright. It's an instance fight. Alright, cool. Uh, pardon the noise if you can hear it. I am moving stuff around. Uh, how long do you, uh, do you mean to keep this up? What is it, what is it you imagine I've done? Enough, enough, I say. It's, it's over then. I, I sold maps and rations to the Empire. Uh, it was I. 
I meant no harm. I only wanted the coin. Everyone wants the coin. The Wheelers are good. Strong. I was proud to join their ranks. Am proud. But they do not provide. They preach justice, honor, and duty. But in the end, it is those with money who do as they will. Who live as they will. So I saw an opportunity to change my fortunes and took it. All I've done, I've done for money. Endangered myself, my home, everything, and everyone I love. Why, my actions have put your life in danger too. And what do you mean by that? Oh boy. This is an ambush, isn't it? Though you do not realize how much. Bloody idiot, did you imagine that you had cornered me? It is not I who is cornered. Garleans, I've brought the Makote bastard. Oh shit, wait, do they know who I am? Permit me a question, if you will. Are all adventurers so deluded as to believe they can challenge the power of Garlemad? You would need a veritable mountain of gil to fund such an endeavor, such as the cost of fighting great power. Or of making it. Or of remaking it, as we will Gridania. Uh-oh. They're all dragoons! Well, not dragoons, but they're all lancers. Whoop. So that's the way of it. Uh, swapped your hard bunk at the barracks for a feathery bed in Garlem... Garlemald, did you? Hey, You there, Makote. You stand here at Old Busk's wish. No? That you don't stand alone. Let's do this. Alright. Since this guy is on us, we're gonna kill this guy first. Are they close enough for me to do fire? Yeah, okay, they are. Oh my god, did I really? Did I really just do that? Alright, so now it's just one of them. Now it's just Laurentius. Um. Hey! Oh god. Alright. guy and then we'll oh we got more uh more help I attacked the wrong person by accident so Okay, there are more people over there, so I'm actually gonna... I cannot attack them. We're gonna kill these guys, because I think the other... The uh, main guy, uh, Laurentius, I think it's fine. Like, we can deal with him later, but like, these guys... Ooh, you know, trim down the numbers, as they would say. Start killing the uh, this guy in the back. I think he's the oh, what is attack? That guy might die. No, please don't tell me that this is like an instance where like if one person dies, everyone is is dead. Please. Okay, it isn't. Uh-oh. I was so scared that um, if one person died, it was the end to the entire thing. Thankfully, it isn't. Nice. Suck on these... Impossible. How did you best the Empire's finest? And with bandits and poachers at your side, they are your sworn enemies. Why do they fight with you and not against you? 
because we have a common enemy. Ooh. Ah, but I know the answer only too well. Buscarin. This is his doing. His words are wont to inspire men to act. Uh, to act. Better men than I. Gods, what have I become? What have I done? Bad things. I... I am sorry. No more will I pursue this folly. No more lies. No more bribes. I will go to the Order of the Twin Adder and confess my crimes. Well, that's good. At least... Own up to your actions. There's something I would like to tell Buscarin. Tell him Laurentius the Fool says thank you. I feel as though a veil has been lifted from before my eyes. Okay, I wouldn't go so far as calling yourself a fool, like that title. But, you know. To each his own, I suppose. Alright. Now we go back. To Buscarin. Let's make sure I'm going the right direction. Yep. I wish it wasn't so dark here. Stupid shroud. Oh wait, Al Alphiliate has a quest for us. Is this the enemy one? Uh, I, Laurentius, confessed to his crimes. I just had word from the Twin Adder. Seems he marched straight to the nest and gave himself up. The lads had quite a life, you know. His mother was killed by a brigand, uh, brigand, brigand when he was only small. As a young man, he joined the Whalers, hoping to spare his fellow Gridanians the misery he'd known growing up. Trouble is, protecting Gridani is too big a job for one man, and he came to believe that he couldn't make a difference, that it was all hopeless. There are a few things more dangerous than desperation, and a man lost in the dark is easily drawn to the glimmer of coin. I reckon he thought that if he couldn't change the lot of his fellow man, oh Jesus, um, he might as well change, uh, change his own. Thing is, he was making a difference, just not on his own. Somehow, he'd failed to grasp one simple truth. And those things we cannot do alone, we must do together. Uh, he asked you to thank me, did he? Then there's good in him yet. I just hope them at the twin a uh, at the adder's nest are able to see it. What he's done ain't easy to forgive, but I'd like to think he'd be afforded a chance to make amends. But let us leave fates to the twelve. I have other news for you, Atelios. The Sylph Elder has been found. <gasps> they have? Ooh woo? Uh, into the Beast's Maw. Ah, this is a dungeon. I already know. Oh, there you two are. It's taking us far. Uh, it's taken us a fair old while, but we finally got our hands on some reliable information concerning the whereabouts of your missing green friend. <clears throat> His name is Frixio, and he is the eldest among the sylphs of Little Solace. Long has he represented his kind in dialogue with the Gridanians. Yes, he's like a bridge between us and them. A little, a small leafy green bridge that we can't find at the moment. And bridges are no use if you don't know where they are. And that's why it's so important that we find him. There's an abandoned dungeon called the Thousand Maws of Toto Rock here in the South Shroud. Twas by the entrance to the place that Frixio was seen, and not long ago neither. If you hurry, I reckon you'll find him. Uh, walking ones, please help this one. This one needs help. Needs help to help Elder One. Poor Frixio, poor, poor Frixio. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold your chocobos. Take a deep breath and tell us what's wrong. Nice and slow. Elder One went to Toto Rock, but has not returned. This one is worried, so very worried. And you're right to be. The place fair crawls with nasties, waiting to make a meal of anyone daft enough to wander in. What in the seven hells was he thinking, entering that bloody death trap? Elder One had no choice. Imperial Ones were chasing Elder One. Please, Walking Ones must help El Elder One. Help Elder One now. Ah, uh, these fates conspire against the fates conspire against us. Forgive my pragmatism, but Frixio is our best hope of reaching an accord with the Sylphs. Were we to lose him, all our efforts thus far have been for naught. I will tend to her wounds. Ida, make haste to the Adder's Nest and request assistance. Understood. A 
Atelios, go to the thousand miles of total rock and see that Frixio comes to no harm. Peace between man and sylph rests upon your success. Un understood. Alright, let's see what this guy has to say though. Let's see what affiliate or you know, whatever how you pronounce that. Um Okay. Your uh your word o guardians in the woods got all but scared besides himself with worry. So I came up with a bit of an idea I did. Might be a herd. Uh there's a place near here where poachers and all other manner of scum gather. They're no friends of Gridania, to be sure, but they're even less love for Garlemod. So I got to thinking, why not ask him to keep an eye on the Garleans in the woods? Enemy, oh my, uh, 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 my enemy, and all that. Okay, yeah, um, yeah, that's true. The enemy of my, oh, jeez, okay. Uh, the enemy of my enemy is my friend, basically. Keep your friends close, but your enemies closer. Um Oh wow, well, they're up there. Okay. How do I get up there though? Oh, I see. What kind of fate is this? Is it that big thing over there? The hunted uh, a giant antelope. Yeah. Cause so I'm gonna hop off my chocobo for this. Oh, I can't hop up there. Okay, never mind. I lied. I thought I could get up from over there, but I guess not. There you go. Uh, Biscarin is worried about Garleans in the wood, is he? The situation must be dire. Very well, I will see to it that any Imperials are watched with a close eye. By the by, you are the Makode making a name for himself of late, are you not? It is good to finally put a face to the name. Cool. Uh, speak with a flyer of the red belly wasps this direction. Oh, there they are. Garleans in the wood? Muscarian would not lie of such things, nor I think would you. Worry not, the wasps are watching. Tell me, are you the Thaumath are you the Thaumathurge rumors speak of? I, I suspected as much. Many wasps are looking forward to the day they cross paths with you, myself included. Until then, friend. Okay, we are we are really quickly making a name for ourselves. Like jeez. Um all right. Oops. Alright. Uh, so, how's the hostility of our enemies? Left a sour taste in your mouth, did it? Pity that. They've no respect for land or law, but they're not within without their uses. Now they know who you are, and that you ain't scared of them. Your name's getting known of late, for better or worse. A lot of folk talking about interest in you. Though at best if you want, uh, you went looking for them before they came looking for you. True. Alright. I think that's uh, all the quests in this area. So now we... Um... Now we gotta go to the Thousand Maws of Toto Rock. Um, which, I wonder how that dungeon's gonna go. Uh, I'm probably gonna, 
you know, of course, look up, like, any, like, mechanics and whatnot, just to make sure I'm not... Whoops. Alright. Yeah. Just to make sure I'm not gonna be doing anything, like, you know, stupid. Or anything. I always make sure to, like, kind of, like, go into a dungeon after I've looked at a brief overview. Uh, by order of the Elder Seed Seer, the dungeon known as the Thousand Maws of Todorok has been placed under the control of... What? The Sylph Elder in is inside? And you are sure of this? How in the seven hells did he manage to sneak by? God, strike me down for a pure blind fool. You must find the Sylph Elder before he pre uh, falls prey to the fiends inside. Entrance to the Todorok is ordinarily restricted, but these are exceptional circumstances. Pray assemble a rescue party and enter as soon as you're ready. Alright, cool. So this episode's actually going to be a bit short. I'm actually going to end this episode right here at 30 minutes because then it will leave me with enough time next episode to, um, to basically um, have the episode for that dungeon, you know? Um, so I'm actually going to edit early. Surprise! Wow, Lyrian never ends his videos early. Um, he never does. But it's there's a first for everything. Also, it gives me time to like look up the dungeon in advance to make sure. Is there anything I should be worried about? Like, oh, is there like a lever I need to pull or anything? So, anyways, I'll see you in the next episode. Take care. Be safe.